a former professional footballer and successful businesswoman's secret life as an accountant for a £1 million drugs gang was exposed after police swooped to arrest her at an airport. Faye Dunn once boasted a portfolio of companies, but now faces a prison stretch of nearly four years. One highlight of her time in football came 20 years ago as a promising teenager playing for England at youth level. Dunn, then 18, helped her team qualify for the semi-finals of the UEFA European Women's Under-19 Championship. The box-to-box -box midfielder turned out for Tranmere Rovers before joining Leeds United in 2003. After hanging up her boots, Dunn, who was a well-known figure in the Heighton area, would give back by setting up Onside Sports Academy. The aim of the community interest company was to support young footballers whose dreams of playing pro had been shattered after being released by clubs and ensuring gainful employment for them. This was one of several directorships she would go on to hold. Her business empire also extended to a restaurant and a popular children's play centre. But the mother of two's fortunes turned in 2020, as COVID-19, lockdowns and their consequences saw her business falter. Liverpool Crown Court heard that this was the catalyst for Dunn becoming involved in the underworld. However, evidence pointed to her money laundering exploits beginning in December 2019. She operated under the handle Stiff Ninja on the encrypted communications platform EncroChat. It was commonly deployed by criminals in keeping their dealings secret until the network was hacked by the authorities during 2020. Messages revealed that she had, quote, involvement in the supply and production of cannabis, being described as, quote, accountant for an organized crime enterprise. She had also smuggled cash to Spain, boarding a Portsmouth to Santander ferry with money hidden in her trousers. Nicola Daly, prosecuting, said, quote, She played an operational role within the drug supply chain, but appeared to have significant influence upon others in the chain, facilitating meetings between criminal associates in relation to the supply of controlled drugs, and also instructed others to undertake tasks, such as the collection and movement of packages of both drugs and cash. Significantly, she appears to have acted as the accountant for the organized criminal enterprise and has concealed not only her EncroChat device, but also cash when traveling abroad in order to evade detection by the authorities. Dunn of Walpole Avenue in Whiston was eventually arrested at Manchester Airport on June 13th this year as part of Operation Venetic. She remained silent under interview, but later pleaded guilty to conspiracy to supply cannabis and money laundering. The fallen entrepreneur was seen to be in tears at various points during her sentencing hearing at Liverpool Crown Court on Tuesday. Dunn wailed and said, quote, I can't believe it, having been jailed for three years and nine months. Sentencing, Judge David Potter said, quote, it is a tragedy to see a young woman facing a sentence of imprisonment after leading a life full of past and continuing achievements. You should have been thinking about your two young children when you became involved in a serious organized crime.